how to create a multi-page website on canva hey guys welcome back in this video i'll show you guys step by step on how you can build a multiple page website on canva because canva currently does not allow you to build multiple pages in one website your website is basically laid out in a longitudinal form and you have different sections but you don't have different pages but i'll show you guys how you can do that with canva so let's jump right in. The first thing you're going to do is you're going to log on to your Canva account. And once you have logged on to your Canva account, you can just click on create blank and start by creating your first website. Now on the left, you will have different templates and even layouts that can help you in building your website. So I will just take this simple layout and I will add my logo here. And this is just going to be Lily's design like this and then i can add my title here dive into fashion explore our designs like this and then on the right i will add an image that is going to be fashionable like this now once i've done that one really major thing is that i want to include a button i don't want to add another page like this because if i add a page right below it it just doesn't feel as dynamic as you know uh something else would like a different page altogether so the way you're going to do this is you are going to and i'll show you guys the differences between this as well so i'll go into layouts and i'll add you know a simple layout like this and i'll just click on some fashionable images so you guys can see the difference i mean in pages so i'll just add this and i also use this as an image now if i want to link to this page although these are separate pages this is even separated by these two you know sections it's still right under it so i'll show you guys a page link in canva versus a page link that i'm gonna develop so to do this first i am going to go into text and i will be using to a simple text box which is going to be buy now uh, like this is a simple buy now button and i will go into the text and click on effects i will have a background and in the background i am going to make it square i'm going to make it a bit big like this and i will not have any transparencies and i'll just use a nice little gray color like this now once i do that i can click on this buy now button and click on more and then i can click on link and link it to my third page like so link and this is going to be the third page here and then click on done now although this is linked to the third page it's not a separate page so the way that i like to build crawlable websites or you know multi-page websites is that first i'm going to click on edit link and i'll delete the link from here i will click on publish website on the top right or you can just save it you can leave it as a saved website and you're going to go back into Canva. Click on websites again and then create another blank website. Now, this is going to be my buy now pages like this. And then in this, I'm going to follow the same thing. I'll just add this image and I'll add a simple text box where it's going to add red blazer like this. And after that, I can click on add heading, which is going to be by our blazer like this over here and after that you know i can add product details but we're going to leave it blank and then i'm going to go on ahead and i'm going to click on publish website for our buy now blazer page click on publish website and in a couple of seconds this page will be published now once this page is published i'm going to copy this link over here and if i copy and paste it this is what the page looks like now I'm going to go back into my original website, okay, and I'm going to click on the buy now button over here, click on these three dots, and then click on link, and I'm not going to link it to the page in the document, I'm going to paste in the separate website link, then click on done, and now I will remove the underline from this as well, and now I can click on publish website, curved and background text effects aren't compatible, okay. I will have to remove the background text, but for that, I am going to click on shapes and I will just add this shape over here in the background and I will convert it into the same color that I previously added. I'll just open this up 
choose the same color and it gives the same appearance. Now I can click on publish website and then click on publish website over here. And now my website is being published. And now you will see what will happen when I click on the buy now button. So I'll view my website like this. This is my website as you guys saw. And if I click on buy now, this leads me to the other page, which is my Canva purchase section. You can do this. Obviously, Canva is not meant for retail. So, you know, buying items is not, you know, a factor that is going to be included in most websites. Usually, you might want to uh, build a separate page for your blog or build a separate page for your gallery. So to do that, you can just go on ahead, and include your basic info over here. Then you can add, you know, your separate pages. Then below that, you can add something like this and you can build a header off of these little bars. And I'm going to use this color over here. And then I'm going to add different buttons or different shapes of buttons. And I will increase the size of this a bit like so. Command C and Command V, and I can build as many pages as I want. I don't recommend building too many pages because they're not interconnected. So people would have to go back to your original link to, you know, link back. But you can add backlinks to both of these together, and that is another really important thing. So if I, instead of our Buy Now Blazer, this is going to be our Blogs page. So I'll click on Edit Design, and this is going to be Blogs. This is our blogs pages. So whatever, you know, pages you want to include, you can add those over here. I'll just add this like this. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go on ahead and use the text link from this section blogs. OK, and I will click on preview. We can preview a site, but we're just going to click on publish website and then publish our website. And then I'm going to copy the link for this one and add it to that one and then copy the link for that one and add it to this one. So you're going to copy the first link and then you're going to go into your website and you are going to hyperlink it. So just click on these three dots, click on link, and then you're going to paste in the link, click on done, click on done, publish your website. So once you've published your second website, you're going to go back into your original blogs pages and you're going to include a link back to it so how you do that is you're going to copy and then you're going to click on edit design and then instead of it just saying blogs on the top i will add home page like this where people can click on this and go back to our home page and i will click on link and then paste in the link for the home page that i'm going to copy from here paste done publish and now that we have published our websites, both of our websites, it's going to just take a few seconds. If I click on blogs, it leads me to blogs. And if I click on homepage from blogs, it leads me back to my homepage. So this is how you create a multi-page Canva website. If you found this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe.